it has been even you know better of an experience than I expected coming into this in terms of getting to raise what we'll learn progressing through the time trial the heat the rep the semi like what Molly and I are learning as a crew I'm just like this is great we've definitely um, needed this I think to keep building towards Switzerland and the women's doubles field this year is great there's so like so much of that depth 16 boats is awesome um i'm glad it really drew out the progression so that again we can keep keep lining up and keep lining up and keep lining up mm -hmm. and, and it's been fun i feel like yeah. i'm waking up like a kid on christmas morning and it's like just getting to be doing this again yeah, it's so bubbly. And it's just, i don't know you know it's like you don't get to do it for a year you realize how much it means to you so we had planned that we go into today like it's the final at Lucerne because only two boats qualify. You gotta go. You gotta do whatever it takes. And so I'm super excited that we get up to line up again before we have to take three weeks back into training. But it was it was the best learning experience. That that race was a wild ride. <laughs> yeah. Those are some fierce competitors. Um, yeah, we we spent most of the race in second, and it was for me focusing on don't let the boat in first pull away. Try to eat into their margin and keep an eye on the boat two lanes over because we know that they're both super strong. We know that they'll have probably have an amazing sprint, so you're not safe. And that's the sort of learning to watch the boats next to us is one of my big goals because you know that's my job is to know where everybody else is while still following Michelle so